Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel. And uh, if you are a, uh, writing a lot in Windows 10, you might have noticed that there's an autocorrect feature that is available. Now, autocorrect is at different levels, first of all. So there could be autocorrect on the web using Google Chrome, for example. There could be autocorrect in Windows. Um, you have to understand where the autocorrect is happening. The majority of places where you write is actually going to be the autocorrect of Windows. Once again, if you use Word, for example, Microsoft Word, you will have autocorrect in Word also. So there are, once again, different places where autocorrect happens. But for the majority of what you type, often the autocorrect will come from Windows. Now, autocorrect feature is great. It helps us write better. But it has also some dark side, which is sometimes correcting words that we don't want to. Sometimes we write something that is autocorrected and we don't want that. It could be if you're like me, writing several languages, uh, you will not want to have autocorrect on some of the languages you actually write. So where is all of this in Windows 10? Unfortunately, Microsoft, I don't know why they put it in that place, but it's really, in my sense, in the wrong place. The autocorrect feature should be with the language settings. If you right click your start menu and go into settings, you might be thinking, well, I'm going to go to time and language. Maybe this is where everything is happening with autocorrect. When in reality, you have to go to devices, devices and typing on the left side. And here is the autocorrect. Now, one of the options is autocorrect misspelled words. The other one is highlight misspelled words. What I often do in Windows is turn off the autocorrect, but leave the highlight misspelled words. Why? By turning off autocorrect, it will not try to correct things I don't want it to correct. But at the same time, if I do misspell a word, the highlight feature will actually give me a little underline telling me, oh, um, this is not written correctly. And you can right click on the word actually and have a suggestion of what word to how it is actually spelled. So this kind of gives you a, you know, an autocorrect capability by telling you when something's wrong, but doesn't mess your text because it wants to do it automatically. So this is where all of this is. If you want to turn it on or off, this is where it happens. Um, on your um, Windows 10 operating system. Remember, autocorrect is at other levels also, so you might have autocorrect in, say, Gmail, which is not Windows related, but Gmail related. You might have autocorrect in Microsoft Word or another app that is app related, not Windows related. So it all depends where you're typing when you're doing something. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching my videos.